Hi and welcome back. If you're new to the channel, my name is Vince. Thanks for stopping by. You're very welcome here indeed. So followers of the channel will know that I do have high, borderline high blood sugar levels, not high enough for a doctor to prescribe metformin or for them to prescribe metformin as a preventative. So in this video, the aim is twofold. Firstly, I'm going to cover the benefits of berberine. Um, I'm also going to do a giveaway or there's a giveaway from Alive by Science. Uh, more on the giveaway later. First of all, let's jump into the presentation and let's look at the benefits of berberine. Berberine is one of the most effective natural supplements available on the market today. Berberine is also one of the very few supplements shown to be as effective as a pharmaceutical drug. Berberine has been shown to lower blood sugar, induce weight loss and improve heart health as well as a few other benefits that I will cover in this video. There are links in the description below to the articles and studies I used to put this presentation together. So what is berberine? Well berberine is a bioactive compound. It can be extracted from several different plants including a group of shrubs called berberis. This is where it gets its name. Technically it belongs to a class of compounds called alkaloids. It is a dark yellow color and because of this it is often used as a dye. Berberine has a long history of use in traditional Chinese medicine where it was and still is used to treat various ailments. Berberine has now been tested in hundreds of different studies, some of which are linked in the description below. It has been shown to have powerful effects on many different biological systems. After you ingest berberine, it is transported via the bloodstream into your body's cells. Inside the cells, it binds to several different molecular targets and changes their function. This, in effect, is how a pharmaceutical drug works. So let's take a look at what positive effects these changes can produce. Type 2 diabetes is a serious disease that has unfortunately become very common in recent years. It causes the death of millions of people every year. It is characterized by elevated blood sugar levels either caused by insulin resistance or by the lack of insulin. Over time high blood sugar levels can damage the body's tissues and organs leading to various health problems and a reduced lifespan and health span. Many studies now show that berberine can significantly reduce blood sugar levels in individuals with type 2 diabetes. In fact, its effectiveness is comparable to the popular diabetes drug metformin. So how does berberine work? Well, it appears to lower blood sugar levels via a number of different mechanisms. It decreases insulin resistance, making the blood sugar lowering hormone insulin more effective. It increases glycolysis, helping the body break down sugar inside our cells. It decreases sugar production in our liver and it slows the breakdown of carbohydrates in our gut. It also increases the number of beneficial bacteria in our gut. So let's take a look at some studies and there are links in the description below to all the studies I'm going to talk about now. In one study of 116 diabetic patients, one gram of berberine per day lowered fasting blood sugar levels by 20%. In other words, from diabetic levels to normal levels. It also lowered hemoglobin A1C by 12%, a marker for long-term blood sugar levels, and also improved blood lipids such as cholesterol and triglycerides. According to a review of 14 studies, Berberine is as effective as prescription oral diabetes drugs, including metformin. It also has a synergistic effect when administered with other blood sugar lowering drugs. But seek the advice of a health professional if you're going to take berberine with another blood sugar lowering drug. Berberine may also be effective as a weight loss supplement. To date, Two studies have examined the effects on body weight and again there are links in the description below to these studies. In a 12-week study in obese individuals, 500 milligrams was administered three times a day. On average, this caused about five pounds of weight loss. The participants also lost 3.6% of their body fat. Another more impressive study was conducted in 37 men and women with metabolic syndrome. This study went on for three months. 
These participants took 300 milligrams three times per day. The participants dropped their body mass index, their BMI, from 31.5 to 27.4, or from obese to overweight in only three months. They also lost belly fat and improved many other health markers. The researchers believe that the weight loss was caused by improved function of fat regulating hormones, such as insulin and leptin. And although very promising, in my humble opinion, much more research is needed on the weight loss effects of berberine. Heart disease is currently the world's most common cause of premature death. Many factors that can be measured in the blood are associated with an increased risk of heart disease. According to a review of 11 studies, and they're listed below, total cholesterol can be reduced by 24 milligrams per deciliter. LDL cholesterol can be lowered by 25 milligrams per deciliter. And berberine can lower triglycerides by 44 milligrams per deciliter. It can also raise HDL cholesterol by 2 milligrams per deciliter. Also, bear in mind that diabetes, high blood sugar levels and obesity are all major risk factors for heart disease, all of which seem to be improved by supplementing with berberine. Berberine may also have other health benefits. Rat studies show that berberine could help to fight depression. And in test tube and animal studies, it was shown that it can help reduce the growth and the spread in various types of cancer. Berberine has also been shown to have potential antioxidant and anti-inflammatory effects. It's also been shown to fight harmful microorganisms, including bacteria, viruses, fungi and parasites. It can also reduce fat buildup in the liver, which should help protect against non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. One study showed that it drastically improved symptoms and reduced the risk of death in heart failure patients. Many of the studies that I've cited use dosages in the range of 900 to 1500 milligrams per day. It's common to take 500 milligrams three times a day before meals, and that's a total of 1500 milligrams per day. Berberine has a half-life of several hours, so it's necessary to spread your dosage out several times a day to achieve stable blood sugar levels. Half-life is the length of time required for the concentration of a particular substance, usually a drug or supplement, to decrease to half of its starting dose in your body. If you have a medical condition or you are taking any type of medication, then it's recommended that you speak to a doctor before taking berberine, especially important if you are currently taking another blood sugar lowering medication. To date, berberine has an outstanding safety profile. The main side effects are related to digestion. That said, cramping is one of the side effects that you may feel if you take berberine. Another is diarrhea and or constipation. Tied into that is flatulence. Luckily, I have not received this, but let me know if you have. And another one possibly is stomach pain. Berberine can also lower blood pressure. Theoretically, berberine might increase the risk of blood pressure becoming too low in people who already have low blood pressure. So seek the advice of a doctor if you have low blood pressure and you're thinking about taking berberine. Pregnancy and breastfeeding. Researchers believe that berberine can cross the placenta and might cause harm to the fetus. It's also likely unsafe to take berberine if you are breastfeeding. Berberine can be transferred to your infant through breast milk and it may cause harm. Well, I hope you found that interesting or informative, hopefully both. Uh, let me know what you think about the video. I specifically would like to hear from people who can get metformin prescribed or they can buy it over the counter and obviously have access to berberine, but have chosen berberine over metformin. I'd like to know the reasons why if those people do exist. So on to the free giveaway. This week's free giveaway is 90 150 milligram capsules of liposomal berberine from Alive by Science. As always, it's third party tested. This normally retails for $49.95. Shipping, as always, 100% free. So if you are lucky enough to win, this will turn up at your doorstep, no charge to you whatsoever. Picking a winner uh, 24 hours after this video airs, which is around 3 p.m. Dubai time, 
I'll ask my son to pick a number. On the toss of a coin, we'll count up or down in the comment section uh, and we will find out who the winner is. That winner will be notified in the community tab. So it's important you subscribed and ideally you rung the notification bell so that you know if you won and also when new videos are posted. So today's question, and I think I've asked this question before, but it was a long time ago when I had uh, far fewer subscribers. Um, I'd like to know somebody who's died in history, either a famous person or someone who's near and dear to you, if you had the chance to meet them one more time, maybe on a park bench and share a coffee or over dinner, um, just let me know who that particular person is. So I hope you enjoyed the video on Berbering. Uh, good luck in the Berbering giveaway.